dot com graphics card graphics card are very important in modern computers their job is to handle most of the graphics work that has to be done by the computer it is a hardware component whose function is to generate and output images to a display it operates on similar principles as a sound card or other peripheral devices the graphics card takes the load off of the cpu so that more graphic information can be used without a graphic card you will not be able to play any recent games that are graphically detailed fast action and a lot going on at one time a lot of computers have integrated graphics chips which are okay for everyday use and even some games but if you want the real deal you need to have an excellent graphics card flash rom the bios is stored in a component called the flash rom read only memory read only memory is a class of storage media used in computers and other electronic devices information stored in rom is stored there permanently meaning that even when the computer is turned off the information stays there in comparison to ram which is volatile there are several types of rom peer rom stands for programmable read only memory it is programmed by a special device and information written on to it is permanently stored there consequently a peer rom can only be programmed once e peer rom stands for erasable programmable read only memory it can be erased through exposure to ultraviolet light and then rewritten with a process that again requires application of higher than usual voltage ea prom stands for electrically alterable programmable read only memory it can be erased electronically but changes can only be made one bit at a time EEP ROM stands for electronically erasable programmable read only memory it can be erased and rewritten to while it is inside the computer flashing the bios is the operation of replacing the instructions stored on the ROM by a set of more efficient ones CMOS complementary metal oxide semiconductor is a type of memory that works with the bios it stores configuration information for the computer this chip contains information about the system configuration that is hard disk type floppy drive types and the order in which the computer will look for bootable disks an important characteristic of a cmos circuit is the duality a cmos circuit is created so that a path would always exist from the output to either the power source or ground cmos devices are high noise immunity and low static power consumption significant power is only drawn when the transistors in the cmos device are switching between on and off states consequently cmos devices do not produce as much waste heat as other forms of logic ports a port is a specialized outlet on a piece of equipment to which a plug or cable connects ports on a computer are sockets that allow devices like keyboard joystick mouse and printer to be connected different types of ports exist each operating at different speeds and meant for different devices the figure shows the different port in a computer usb connect printers digital cameras pen drives serial port connect some types of modem parallel port connect printers ps2 port used for keyboards and mouse modem connect computers to the internet network port connect computers to networks power connect the computer to power supply see these two figures 
USB ports are connectors which are often used to connect digital cameras, scanners, printers to the computer. The USB Universal Serial Bus 2.0 allows transfer speeds of up to 480 Mbps. A technology similar to the USB is the FireWire which supports speeds of up to 800 Mbps. Expansion Card An expansion card can be inserted into an expansion slot of a computer motherboard to add additional functionality to a computer system. Examples of these cards are Modem It allows a computer to be connected to the Internet. Sound Card This is an expansion card that is plugged in on the motherboard that will allow us to have sound output TV card. Basically, it will allow you to listen to radio and watch TV on your computer. Network card. This allows a computer to be connected to a network. Ethernet network cards are available that will allow a PC to connect to a network.